All right, regarding the HCS12 microprocessor. So two hex letters is one byte. The HCS12 microprocessor stores one byte words, like CE, F2, 80, whatever, in its memory, which is RAM and ROM. But the address of these memories happens to be two bytes long. That's four hex letters. So it's kind of like this. Look, these addresses are bigger than the actual uh, box itself. So what's inside hex 8006? Oh, it happens to be one byte uh, 7F. Because remember, number seven, each of these can be broken down into a nibble. So seven is zero, one, 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 and then F, of course, that, okay, one byte. What's inside 8007? Just two hex letters. Okay? So here's this S right here on page 139. All right. Uh, what does the instruction load register X at this address do? Well, I know register X is a 16-bit address. I might want to be tempted to say it's going to load it with the value stored at that address. But that would be wrong. It loads it. It's the memory location of uh, hex 1234 and 1235. So why is that? Okay. X wants four hex letters, basically, right? And what it's going to do anytime we load or store, the instruction is always referring to the most significant bit. Look at this. Store at this address, 1234. The most significant bit is going to go at 1234, then the least significant. And same thing when we load, load at 1234. It's talking with respect to the most significant bit. And that is what the big Indian system is, by the way.